This is a, an artwork by Dagna Jakubowska, developed together with Joanna Gawrońska Kula and Adam Kapler. Uh, the title of this work is Weeds, and it belongs to a whole series of works called The Edible Map of Migration. Uh, Dagna Jakubowska explores here invasive plants, uh, and she um, prepared a collection of preserves out of these plants. As you see, the, the preserves, they, they look uh, as, as some kind of uh, alchemic substances, and the whole table looks like some kind of an alchemist laboratory and uh, uh, there are stains uh, actually on the tablecloth and it's not that we uh, did something wrong actually during the opening of the exhibition uh, Dagna and Joanna presented a performance uh, and during uh, the performance we could eat uh, uh, we could eat the preserve we could, we could drink and eat and they prepared a lot of really delicious uh, dishes uh, out of these invasive uh, plants uh, this whole um, body of work is really based on a very extensive research. Uh, Dagna collects uh, these plants, uh, observes them and invents uh, recipes uh, uh, and it's, it's really a, a long-term uh, project. What is also interesting for her is how media write about these plants. Uh, um, because uh, it seems that uh, the force of these plants is really reflected in the media. For example, I'm, I'm standing to a text um, dedicated to uh, Japanese knotweed, uh, and, and here uh, Dagna uh, quote um, uh, newspaper articles uh, uh, that say that uh, this is a, uh, this plant is a the va volcanic pioneer that strikes back, uh, or the colonial revenge. If there is a weakness, knotweed will exploit it. So these plants are, are described as, as some kind of agents, as uh, destructive, uh, dangerous forces. Um, of course, very often this uh, uh, image of this plant is not entirely true. It depends on the context. You know, sometimes the same plant is uh, presented as an invasive plant, uh, but in another place it will be presented as a plant that contributes to biological diversity. So these media articles, they are not always 100% uh, you know, objective or they are always uh, 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 using a particular perspective. Uh, uh, so yeah, so what Dagna, uh, Dagna really uh, collected all this information and we provide them for you in this uh, folder. Uh, and it's really a, a, a type of a, a project that everyone can undertake, everyone can collect plants, every, everyone can cook from them. Uh, uh, in uh, uh, the, per the performance of Dagna was a sort of a ritual. Yeah? And the idea is to also not only to enjoy the, the taste of these plants, but also to be inspired by, by their resistance, by their indifference uh, to uh, political borders or borders in general, uh, inspired by their uh, uh, ability to adapt to very different conditions. Uh, uh, there are actually quite many, many things that uh, we can uh, learn from, from these plants. Uh, uh, and, uh, uh, and this is uh, something that everybody can, can uh, undertake. <laughs>